Hey y'all, welcome back to the lab. So in this video, we're gonna be talking about how to delete an app on Coolify. And so I've been using Coolify for the past several weeks to host several of my side projects, as you can see here. Um, and so at some point, you're probably gonna need to delete an app, and that's what's happened here. I've created this, you know, random app uh, to kind of provide an example for how to use Coolify for other things. You can see my other videos for that. Um, and so now we need to delete it. And so we'll just walk through that here. Um, so here I am just on my projects page. I've gone into Tammy Labs, which is my um, project where all my apps are living right now. And I've gotten several of these apps running on one of my VPSs. Um, and so I wanna delete this one. And so to delete it, basically we'll just go in here, um, which will take us to the app configuration page. And we're going to go down this left bar to find the danger zone um, tab. And then we're gonna go here to this delete resource section and we're gonna click delete. And it's gonna be like, you know, we're gonna delete your volumes, we're gonna delete your networks, we're gonna delete your configuration files, we're gonna um, delete all the Docker stuff, um, you know, basically deleting everything. I think these are checkboxes. Yeah, so you can choose if you want to do them or not. Um, but if you're like deleting it permanently like me and you don't care about it, then you can just check everything. And then we'll click continue here. And then it's gonna be like, are you sure about this? And then we just need to copy and paste the name in here, resource name. And then we click continue. And then it's like, you want a final confirmation. You need to enter your password. I got my password here and we will click permanently delete. It said that was incorrect. Um, hopefully this is my real password. And we'll click permanently delete and we see it is gone. Now, is it actually gone? Uh, we hope so, um, but you know, I don't really have a great way to check. I guess I could go into my VPS and, and you know, look at the files and stuff, but we at least know it's gone from Coolify. We're just gonna assume that it actually went and cleaned this up. Um, so that's how you delete an app on Coolify. Now, if you like this post, you might also like this other video here on why Zig is migrating from AWS to self-hosted to give some more ideas of like why people might choose Coolify, why people are choosing um, VPS kind of doing a mass migration away from the cloud, that might be interesting to you. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.